Worcester Market is known for its busy commercial activities in the FCT and it has never been associated with political, religious or ethnic rallies. The recent presence of the anti buari group led by Charles Oputa, also known as Charlie Boy, calling President Mamadou Buari to return back to the country from London or resign was greeted with rejection from many of the northern traders in the market. This rejection later sparked into a huge violence and clash between the pro-Buari group and the anti-Buari group, leading to an attack on Charlie Boy and his group and also a closure of the market. Against this backdrop, traders have come to condemn Charlie Boy's presence in the market. I advise to anybody that wants to protest, he has to know where to do it, not in the market or not any public place. Riot is happening by the streets and others, uh, government uh, offices. Like where you show you are angry, then government hear from you, they do something about it. Not in the market. Market is not an office or somewhere else that you can come and protest. So that's my advice to anybody that wants to protest. Not only Charlie Boy, all over the nation. If you want protest, so don't come to the market. Because that will cause another problem. Like what happened yesterday. If you want to do any protest, you should follow the legal and the legitimate means. Like Charlie Boy now, yesterday that he came to this market, I don't think that he came for protest. Like, like two weeks ago, he made mention that Buhari should come back or resign. It's just his own perception. It's just his own opinion. It's not a legislator, you understand? It's not the House of Senate or House of Assembly. He just spoke his mindset. So anybody can just come out, even when you go to vendor stand at time. So a person will be criticizing this government or this and that. Like, yeah. I advise that if Charlie Boy, whatever he do with it, let's say he, do, he go away, then Buhari no support. But if you go anywhere who has Buhari support, of course you will suffer. I am saying, you say, if they are to do their rally in any kind of rally, it's not good to bring it inside the market. You understand? You are doing your rally, you know, you know how you are benefiting from your rally. And we know what you are benefiting in the market where we are trying to do one or two things and make money that we use and sustain our families. You understand? You don't bring it to a business place. You do it on the street where we will see you, we hail you, you understand? And we walk away. You are doing your own way to where we do. It's not everybody that have time for this nonsense in this country. So that is just my, my advice that the country should come together. Let us have peace because it is good to be good. It's good to be good. Thank you very much. What happened yesterday, it was so unfortunate that uh, this kind of uh, demonstration should come inside the market because we have different opinions, especially in, in inside the market, it ought not to have happened. And you have been taken to outside the market. But in similar light, the official of the market under the umbrella of Abuja Markets Management Limited, Innocent Amichina, head of corporate affairs, has come out to clear the air on the clash. The protesters left the market. There was this division between some of the traders who did not like the attack on the protesters and those who uh, seemed to be in support of what was done to them because according to those people, he shouldn't have even brought this into the market. As different views and opinions continue to pour in following the clash between the Charlie Boys group and some traders here in Wuse Market, activity seems to have normalized. Austin Peacemaker, BTV News.